Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another very exciting video here at Glancet Games and today I proudly present to you Pumpkin Jack. If I uploaded everything correctly, this should be the first video with facecam, so hey everybody, nice to meet you. And we are continuing with the story. I think we do not really have that much anymore, maybe one to one and a half an hour or so. But we ended up right here, we are at the graveyard foggy forest level. Before we continue fighting against the gargoyles over there, I would suggest... That's better. Yeah, and we definitely need the drink, because we are getting already attacked. What the fuck, dude? There you go. I have to get familiar with the controls again. It has been quite a while since we've been in this game. It's quiet. Too quiet. I got a bad feeling about this one, Jack. Don't fear, little one. I am here. And whatever it takes, I will protect you. Wait. Do you hear that? It's headed straight for us. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa. Whoa. I didn't see that coming. Holy shit. That was so out of nowhere. So it's like Flappy Birds, but with gargoyles. All right. Oh, sounds almost like me because I'm panicking. Oh. <laughs> and around the corner. Careful with the feet. Open sesame. Thank you. And we made it. Holy shit. High flyer, go for a nice walk with Embolard the Gargoyle. I see, so we even got a steam achievement for that. And now he's attacking us. You were just taking us for a flight. You were basically our air uber, and now you're trying to kill me. There you go. Come here, you little traitor. Take that, you big dummy. The sky for the big birds, not for you, giant turds. I couldn't have phrased it better. This is exactly how it is. Did I mention I hate gargoyles? I hate them so much. Yeah, they can be stone cold at times. Ho oh, oh, ho, Jack! Hello again! You again? Ah, good grief. How did you get here before we did? Gravekeeper's secret. Ho 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 ho! No matter. Let me through. I think you know by now. It isn't that easy. Let me guess another test. I need you to clear away all these old headstones. <clears throat> okay, give me a second. I need to drink something. Yeah, all that professional voice acting is really getting on my vocal cords. I'm just a little gravekeeper, and I've got no more room for any new graves. When did I become the whole world's errand boy? Good question. Okay, so we have 16 tombstones to clear out. Hopefully, they are just staying that way, and there's nobody coming out of them. Not one singular zombie. I can already hear them. Ga -ga 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 -ga. Ground attack! Alright, where's the ghost fucker? There he is. Yeah, I hate these phantom warriors. They have a cool design, but they really get on my nerves. Okay, for now it seems quite easy, but I bet this is not going to stay that way. Oh, and there's another challenge, but let's do that after our cleaning. Rip Jack. Wait, that is our tombstone? Can we do anything with that? Oh, oh, besides setting myself on fire. Whoops, my bad. One to go. Where's the last one? Where are you hiding? You cannot hide from me, boy. Oh, wait, maybe the last one is in the catacombs. Let's see. Yeah, it actually is. And another crow skull. Five out of 20. So far, so good. Now you gotta... Oof. Uh. <laughs> Do that thing with your head, I guess. Taking part in the challenge is mandatory for our progress. So where is the challenge? Where do I have to perform my head spin? Right here. So. And there we are. Have you missed me? Pumpkin-chan. <laughs> so we have to smash other tombstones. So quite a similar test to the one before. Wait, there's a note. Hector Johnson. William Wilson. Do we have to find pairs? So, Pamek Coffin and... Yes, nice. Now my memory comes in handy. Are you fucking kidding me? Luke and Leia right next to each other. Star Wars sends his finest regards from a galaxy far, far away. And onto the last one. Hector Johnson. And Harry Johnson. I hope we didn't wake up anyone. I hope so too. Ain't no rest for the wicked. Another steam achievement. Done and dusted. Dead ahead. One more time. I've already seen it. No problem. Oh, okay. Maybe a problem. I cannot see shit. I cannot see shit. I'm pressing the wrong button. Ooh. Yeah, you still have much to learn, young grasshopper. Indeed, I have to relearn the button layout again. I'm still so, like, focused on the games that I've played before. Hold your horses, Jack. I'm trying. Don't look down. Oh. <clears throat> and another achievement. Six out of 20. Let's go. 
Ah, ah, shit. Damn it. Right in the pumpkin. Oh, what did my eyes see? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Open eyes always gets rewarded. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but that one was so well hidden. Holy shit. Oh, there's that vertigo again. It's a bit shaky here. The structural integrity is not guaranteed. Oh, and a zipline. Use zipline with the greatest pleasure. Yippee. Woo. Don't you run away, boy. No, 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 no. Not with me. Easy. But before we take care of the gargoyle, take this one down. Don't walk away, brother. He built an entire new structure? Oh, my bad. Yeah, that guy was definitely a Fortnite pro. As soon as he got attacked, he pulled out his blueprint and was like... Ta -ta 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 -ta. <laughs> oh no, they're puking again. Stop puking. And I would really love to unlock another costume. But where's the merchant? I haven't seen him for quite a while. I do want to spend my money indeed. Maybe if we go this way, that looks like an alternative route. Merchant, where are you? Where are you hiding? Oh, we are getting rewarded left and right. Holy moly. 11 out of 20. Yeah, but with all that collectibles, that means that the merchant has to be somewhere near. Finally, the cathedral. I wonder if anyone's home. Yeah, it looks like it. A very interesting being up ahead. Hopefully not a boss. That guy looks way too cool to fight against. I mean, it would still be a cool boss fight, that's for sure, but... I wanna have some friends in this game besides the crow. Nothing against you, little fella, right? You have been a good companion the entire game through. But it just needs some variety, you know? So there are light streaks right above the gates. That means we have to trigger something to open it. And I bet this has something to do with the holy ghost in the cathedral. So let's pay him a visit. Or her. Don't wanna assume any genders here. I am the architect of hell. My master tasked me with waiting for your arrival here. I am responsible for all construction and maintenance of system. I have devised a way to open a similar portal that will place you right behind the wizard. Perfect. At least someone helpful. First, you must... Ah, dang it. Spoke too soon. A portal requires energy, Jack. Around the cemetery lie statues that contain the powers of the seven deadly sins. Break them all to release all the powers of the sins, and I can open the portal. Hurry, Jack. With every passing moment, the wizard's power grows stronger. Yeah, then let's do not waste any minute. Give one crow skull. Huh? What is that? Wait, I have to sacrifice my crow skulls to progress in the story? Or is that just an alternative route that we can take after our mission? And the first statue. Break it! Okay, so as it seems, we have destroyed the Statue of Wrath. And now we have to look for the other six deadly sins. So where's Eskinor? Eskinor, where you at? Yeah, to all my enemy fans out there, a little nod. They are fake skulls that do damage. We cannot even destroy them, so they are just reacting to our touch. Ouch! Right in my pumpkin. Maybe we can jump around? Yes. And another statue. Which deadly sin are we going to break? Envy. The sin of envy. I see, I see. And another zip line. Let's go! Boop, boop. Thank God we are not holding on with our bare hands. Oh, oh. hello, Jack. Hello, wizard. Forget it, you toad. I'm not doing any more tests or favors for you or anyone else. I've spent far too long this whole trip running around doing cheap open sesame tricks. Hey, do not steal my line, Pumpkin Jack. Open sesame is my property, intellectual property of Glancet Games. You wanted to know how I get around the cemetery, right? Oh, hey, Billard. Fetch, boy. Wait, the wizard is controlling the gargoyles? Nah, brother. Ho! Oh. Oh, this is all so sudden. Da, 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 da. Oh, oh, ouch, 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 ouch. My pumpkin jewels are getting scratched on the floor. I think I need all my concentration right now. Focus. Hardest worker in the room. The wolf is always scratching on the door. I need all Dwayne Johnson motivational quotes to get through here. Oh, all right, we made it. And don't you dare build another one. No, 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 no. Not this time. Not with me. Take that, you big dummy. Exactly. Take that, you big dummy. The pumpkin and the crow are an unstoppable duo. A broken heart. We had wrath. We had envy. Is that despair? Oh, sin of lust. Ah, completely wrong. Damn it. All right, but still four statues to destroy. That means there's still work to be done. Merchant, pleasure to meet you. I've got new skins in stock. All right, then let's see. We have 44 crows. That means we can go on a shopping spree. So the buzzard is the most expensive one and probably the coolest. We didn't buy anything in the last episode. So let's buy that one. 
There we are, the buzzard. Let's look at it in close up. Yes. Oh, that is cool. That fits so well with our crow. We even got more visible butt cheeks. Yeah, that purchase was quite worth it. With no further ado in our new bootylicious attire, we can look for the other deadly sins. And what do I see there? Another dance session in our new outfit. Woo. Oh, yes. Sturdy, huh? Let, let's go. Woo. Yeah, that was absolutely worth it. Another gramophone discovered. I would even say these are one of the most entertaining collectibles that you can find, especially with these little dance animations in between. Oh, this skull over here seems to be real. Damn it. Gosh darn it. And there's another statue this time. Let's see, what is that? That is greed, definitely. Yep. The statue contained the sin of greed. Oh, so for the next sin, we have to overcome another challenge. So. Ah. Arigato gozaimasu, pumpkin chan. <laughs> oh, is that memory all over again? Okay, so this is a big ass graveyard. Same procedure as the one before, but with way more tombstones. Eric Hartman? Oh my god, they have killed Eric. You bastards. Gandalf the White. And Tolkien the White. What a nice nod to Lord of the Rings. And Dr. Figgis. You have completely wrecked the cemetery. So what do we have here? Plants? Palm trees? Sin of Sloth. Oh, so the palm trees are like a symbol for like relaxing, not doing anything, for being lazy. Uh, do not mind me. Continue working, guys. I respect the hardworking blue collar community. Oh my God, do you see how high we can climb? Even though it is quite foggy, can almost see the entire map. And there it is. The lion means pride. Yeah, the statue contained the sin of pride. Aren't we all just amazing? Well done, Jack. We're almost ready. Head to the crypt in front of the cathedral. One task remains. <laughs> Leap of faith? Wait, no way, Crow. Leap of faith? Uh, I like all these notches to very, very famous video game series. They are shout out to the people who play Assassin's Creed or have played it. So see what is inside the box. Then let's have a look. That is not a box. Jump for it, Jack. Okay, what do we have to do here? Jump, jump, jump. I feel like a rabbit. Oh, we can jump into the portal now. Wait a minute. Gay high with it. Ten toes when I'm sending on business. I'm a big stepper, underground mecha. <laughs> Wait, maybe we have to destroy the pillars. Nice. All right. First round done and dusted. Just evade, just evade. We are just running and floating. I'm just trying to ignore the fact that there is a haunted house right in the middle of a place that is trying to kill us. And jump, 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 jump. <sighs> oh, nice. Okay, the rhythm changed, but do not worry, pumpkin. I'm in control. Evade. Oh, okay, that was a close one. Let's go. Hunger killer. And now we can break the last statue, gluttony. Let's go talk to that weirdo, the architect. Guys, thank you very much for believing in me. High five. I wasn't aware that I can kill the night owls. Oops. The seven deadly sins have been released from their containment. That's what you meant? I thought these statues were just enchanted or something. You have set them free, and with their power loose, I can open a portal to the north. So we basically sent humanity into doomsday, but now we can open the portal. I mean, that is a good trait. I grant you, Carrion, companion, a touch of my gifts of self-duplication. The fate of the world rests in your hands, Jack. And there's a portal. What? <laughs> and there we are in the domain expansion of the wizard and now our skin is really fitting the environment and it seems that we're already having our new ability at hand Kaka, the architect give, gave you a new spell during the loading screen try it this is your last chance to take that run down jack if i don't freeze solid and shatter first think warm thoughts jack i can think about anna de Armas. Mm. And I don't mean that in an overly sexual way, but in my opinion, Anna de Armas is attractiveness embodied. You cannot tell me otherwise. I mean, look at her. Here, right there. 
How can you say no? Sinister snowman coming up. Jack, put those creeps on ice. Oh, yeah, indeed. Pumpkin snowman. Oh, he's order ordering me. What secondary attack is that? Holy shit. A downward punch? That was a solid rock I fell through. Drink up, fella. There's a long way ahead of us. You're using my magic bridges? Lack of brains and lack of manners must go hand in hand. Yeah, it seems that the wizard has felt a disturbance in the force. Yeah, that looks halfway walkable. Oh, okay. I hope these things are solid. Yeah, me too. And... 420! Happy 420! <laughs> <laughs> and now we are in a Christmas winter wonder world. I mean, how cool would that be, guys, if we were not fighting the wizard, but like a dark version of the Santa Claus. A dark version of the Santa Claus as a final boss would make this game an 11 out of 10. These trees look sharp, Jack. Keep your distance as they spin. These are enemies? Hostile Christmas trees. Now I have seen everything. Yeah, under this tree there will be no presents, just pain. What the fuck did we just perform there? Wait a minute, ho ho, who is there? No way. No, they did not. If my expectation is correct and there's a dark version of the Santa Claus, I'm losing my shit. Ho ho, who goes there? Oh no, Santa Claus? The very same, ho ho ho. And you've been very naughty. The wizard has given me just the magic to stop you, Jack. Come out here and stop me then. Are you kidding? I've got toys to make. You'd rather make your toys than stop me from dooming the whole world? That's capitalism, ho ho ho. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, without capitalism, there is no business for the Santa Claus. But it seems that there's only one way to overcome the Santa Claus, the bad Santa Claus, that is getting into his factory, into his little tinker house. But I would say, guys, we leave this for the next episode because we have been through a lot today. Thank you very, very much for tuning in. And if you like this video, then be sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe and also ring the bell to never miss out on future content here at Glancet Games. And as always, stay safe, play fair and keep gaming. This is Glancet Games. Over and out.